Hi, I'm Balaji Seshadri, Product Marketing Manager at Microchip Technology. In today's video, we are going to show you the basic setup of the USB clock using MPLAB Code Configurator. For today's demonstration, we will be using the PIC24FJ256GB412 device, which is a 16-bit microcontroller that features integrated USB, hardware crypto module, and extreme low power. Before we start, please make sure you have the latest MPLABX IDE, XC16 compiler, and the MCC plugin installed. If you do not have them installed, please visit microchip.com to download the latest versions. So let's get started. First, let's open MPLABX IDE and create a new standalone project using the PIC24FJ256GB412 as the target device. Using the same project wizard, we also select the XC16 compiler toolchain and give the project a name. Once the new project is set up, let's fire up the code configurator from the toolbar. After MCC is open, let's navigate to the Project Resources tab to set up the USB clock. In the System Module Composer window, select the PLL Enable. Next, click on the Prescaler dropdown and set it to 1 is to 1 ratio and notice the USB clock frequency is set to 48 MHz. This can be used for full-speed USB applications. Furthermore, if you want a 24 MHz USB clock, select the prescaler ratio to 1 is to 2 and see the USB clock change to 24 MHz. Using MCC to set up your USB clock gives you a visual confirmation of the USB clock that will be fed to the USB module unlike the traditional method in which you have to physically measure the clock to verify the 48 MHz output. In addition to the visual representation of the USB clock setup, it also auto-generates the configuration bits corresponding to the changes made in the GUI. To see the config bits that reflect the above USB setup, let's navigate to the Project tab and then Source Files, then to the MCC generated files, and finally to the MCC.C file. Here, you'll notice the Config Bits section reflects the USB clock setup we just made earlier. That's all for today. Thank you for tuning in. And for more information on MCC, please visit microchip.com slash MCC.